For today's Read Aloud series, we will be reading A Week of Ties by Ange C.P. and illustrated by Anthony Charles A. Carlyle for Braille Petite. This story is about Charlie's dad and his many ties. And by the end of this, you should hopefully also know the names of the days of the week. Let's begin! Every day, Charles sits on Dad's bed and sighs as he watches Dad and his parade of ties. On Mondays, Dad's ties are pretty tight. He's always on a rush to get to the bus, and he doesn't even pause to pray. Charlie doesn't like Monday ties for Dad. On Tuesdays, Dad's ties are rather bright. He will put cream on his hair and a smile he will wear. Too bad he doesn't have time to play. Tuesday ties make Charlie a bit sad. On Wednesdays, Dad's ties are quite lumpy. He's got a lot on his mind. He sees keys he can't find. Again, he doesn't have time to stay. Wednesday ties make Charlie mad. Look at Charlie here. So mad. On Thursdays, Dad's ties are quite frumpy. He walks around the halls and makes a lot of calls. It's another he doesn't have time day. Thursday's ties make Charlie feel quite bad. On Fridays, Dad's ties look like a mess. He drinks coffee and tea so he doesn't feel sleepy. He doesn't ask, was your week okay? Because oh, what a week Charlie had. Look at Charlie looking so exhausted. But on weekends, Dad's ties are the best. On Saturdays, he wears a spinning tie upon his chest and a big red nose that honks when pressed. He tucks Charlie in when it's time to rest. Look at Charlie looking so happy. On Sundays, he ties his ties upon a string and uses it to make a sling. They go to the parks to ride the swing. Oh, Charlie feels like he is king. Weekends make Charlie feel quite giddy and glad because Charlie gets time to spend with his dad. Look at him, he looks so happy and so glad to be with his dad. The end. So I hope that you learned the names of the days of the week through Charlie and a week of ties. Thank you for spending this time with me and do check out our other read aloud books. Bye!